Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Scorpio November 2, 2022. An emphasis on the sector of joy in your solar chart is boosting these days. Today, minor challenging aspects suggest that your pursuits and pleasures might interfere with other life departments. It may be that your desire for appreciation and admiration is so strong that it leaves you vulnerable to mood swings, for example. Exchanges can be fraught with tension or subtext. You may be facing some childishness in others or impatience in yourself. A better bet for the day is to maintain some detachment on an emotional level. Try not to stir up trouble over tiny matters. Otherwise, your motivation to do something meaningful is powerful today and tomorrow. You might thoroughly enjoy learning something new or developing your specialized skills or knowledge, which makes you feel stronger. Creatively speaking, things are picking up steam. Your ability to make all parties feel included helps you and boosts your position with others. Whenever you experience a solar eclipse in the zodiac sign of Scorpio, you feel especially called to action. This is because Scorpio is a water sign element, just like you. All solar eclipses in Scorpio elicit tremendous passion and intensity in the cosmos, forcing us to witness make or break situations in relationships. On the one hand, this can help partnerships to grow stronger as they face the raw truth and authenticity underneath everything without masks, games, or barriers. Yet, if our connections are not aligned, it can cause us to stand up for ourselves or leave them behind us altogether. Harness your power. Your unconventional business and financial skills are incredible resources as the moon enters Aquarius. Luna is shining an impeccable light on your atypical skills, making this the perfect time to go over your financial matters with a different perspective. Having an unconventional outlook or approach could lead to unique financial opportunities. You may see merit in investing in a startup or to budget in a revolutionary way. Your retirement plans might be more progressive than traditional ones as well. Embrace your spunky approach to reap the benefits from your money matters. While the moon returns to your financial sector every four weeks and is always a valuable chance to check in, this first visit since Saturn's direct turn is even more significant. It was only eight days ago that Saturn's last retrograde phase here for another three decades ended with the moon returning with a chance to become more emotionally and intuitively engaged as things start to move forward. The place to focus your energies these days is in your home. Give yourself time to putter around, and even if you don't actually clean or tidy up, it will be useful to make a list of things that you want to do. The configuration of the planets will support the disciplined attention you give to your home. Maybe it is time to start cleaning out some of the clutter that has miraculously accumulated in corners you don't go through regularly. Open your eyes to your kitchen and bathroom especially and discover what you need to make your life better. This day will mark the beginning of the new cycle for the perfect number that you are. A cycle of positive vibrations that will translate into a new enthusiasm and a real generosity towards those close to you and above all a singular chance for a few days. Most notably, you could bring a new project to life with the participation of your friends or members of your family. They should be happy because you will certainly be successful in your undertaking. In between Jupiter retrograding back out of your career sector for days ago and Venus return to your work sector in two weeks to kick off what could be a busy end to this professional year, there is a chance to pause. As you move into the new working week the planets that are likely to be drawing your attention are the planets in a fun, playful, romantic and creative part of your chart and Jupiter, in his first full week back in an adventurous part. As the moon wraps up its monthly visit to your relationship sector this was always going to leave you feeling more emotionally engaged. This first visit since Pluto's direct turn here has also been your first chance in five months to look to the future rather than the past and based on what it saw, a chance to look to the future with confidence. Our eyes in the sky. Today is a special day for all the fantastic beings on this planet and in the outer realms. Happy Halloween to all the ghosts, ghouls, witches and ancestors. 
The spirit of Samhain doesn't hold back under a powerful moon in Aquarius. This is your time to shine and let the potent energy open major energetic portals. This is a beautiful day of respect and honor in many cultures around the world. For those who practice rituals, set up your altar to your loved ones and those beings roaming the earth. Setting out flowers, letters and offerings in the name of the death realms will help to honor and protect those who have been watching over you for a long time. A trend begins today that will be operating for the next three weeks. The theme of this trend is sensitivity and cooperation with others. You will find that your overall luck is much more favorable when you are in better favor with those around you. Because the veils are extremely thin now, you can use candle magic to help you and have your messages answered by your guides. There could be many paranormal experiences happening at once, especially with the lunar energy playing its hand during this special holiday. You might find your hair standing on end with all the electricity in the air. Have a little fun with the experience. The overall day is a testament to what Scorpio season does best. In the pre-dawn hours, the sun trines Juno, causing us to feel confident in our contractual relationships. The Scorpio sun makes us loyal, passionate, and discriminating. Its trine to Juno in Pisces helps us to understand that people change and situations are constantly in flux. We must not only have trust in others, but we must also trust in this mutable dynamic. If we expect things to always stay the same, we rob ourselves of a chance to grow and evolve. Having faith makes our contracts less stressful, which perpetuates trust and intimacy. Relationships that begin under this influence would be bonded by spiritual or creative inspiration. In the morning, the Capricorn moon sextiles Jupiter in Pisces, enhancing our intuition. A blend of practicality and idealism allows us to make an imaginative dream manifest in the physical world. At this time, we are in touch with our inner humanitarian. We may become interested in a spiritual or educational practice, eager to leave something behind that has a healing impact on others. We lead with integrity and others want to partner with us because they respect our vision. The moon then falls into a short void lasting about a half hour.